Days of day when we find out the top hole is, is on the empty list and your minutes there, and I don't know if you'd be a guy in line to maybe take some of those minutes. How do you, how do you view this as an opportunity for yourself? Uh, for me, it's one at a time. You know, hopefully, you know, I can get back to the lineup and. Uh, you know, jump in, get some uh, get some good ice time, and get ready to roll. You know, I'm excited to get back in the lineup when I get a chance. So hopefully, uh, you know, sooner or later. You were a healthy scratch a handful of times, more than a handful of times last season too. I'm I'm just curious, what sort of mindset do you have to be in to you know keep yourself in it and you know keep yourself motivated as well? Um, it's really hard, you know. Uh, uh, it's not as easy as people think sometimes, you know. And uh, but you know, it's just uh, it just it comes from you. You know, every day you try to wake up, you, you think it's a new day, and uh, you go back to work, you know, I think my work ethic, you know, is good. So try to keep that up, you know, obviously it's not, hard, it's not easy with your motivation sometimes, but you just got to keep uh, go through it, you know. Good training camp. Did you feel like you showed a lot of improvement? And if so, specifically, like where, what parts of your game do you think you showed where you improved? Absolutely. You know, I had a good camp in general, just, you know, like being like a more like a complete player, like two-way player. Something. You know, it was going well. I was on the third line the whole camp. And, you know, some, there's just some things you can't control sometimes. So, you know, I'm, I'm sure they saw some improvement. I'm just going to keep improving as well. And, uh, you know, hopefully it pays off eventually. But even the fact that you stayed here, that you didn't, they didn't ask you to go to the AHL or anything, did that show you that, that you are maybe making some strides? I mean, yeah, but I've been, I've been with them for a year and a half now. And without going down, you know, hopefully it won't happen. But I think I can play here. And, uh, you know, I'm ready to take the next step whenever I get back on the ice. What, what you say take the next step. What do you need to do? What is the next thing you need to do? What is the thing you need to add to your game or, or whatever? Play hard, play physical, just skate a lot too. You know, skating is strength for me. Just, you know, being good also, like both sides. Yes, you, you basically want to, want to like, uh, get the, the trust of your coach, you know, because as soon as you get the trust of your coach, you play a little more and eventually more and more, and things started kind of rolling out for you. So, you know, just hopefully soon, you know, just got to keep playing hard and then working on my game, and hopefully, yeah, you know, it's going to go on. Does that also include making sure you're at every optional skate and stuff like that? Oh, I mean, like, uh, veteran, but now I would always probably just go skate, you know. I kind of like to just do something in my day. So working out and skating every day is pretty much what I do. You, you, you know, when you first got here, we, you know, we talked to you about being a goal scorer at every level, mm -hmm. um, coming up, World Juniors, all that. Are you a different player than you were then, or is it just harder, or what is, you know, what is I mean, it, it's just you don't have the same role right now, you know? Like, it's, it's it, obviously, if you, get a, if you get a chance to be on a goal scoring position, like, player, you know, and they give you, like, the option to do it, and you don't do it, then, you know, it's you, but I didn't really get that opportunity yet, which is fine too. You know, I, I'm in a different role right now. I just got to keep working, and you know, eventually, like things might unfold differently for me. But you know, as of right now, they're asking me something different, the more physical, two-way games, and skating. So you know, that's fine with me. And eventually, you never know what what can happen this league. You know, we see how many players, uh, you know, change their role. Some people just change every year. So we'll see. Are you okay though? You know, being that physical player as opposed to that, you know, that goal scorer guy. Yeah, it's something I can add to my game. And you know, as I said, eventually, if I kind of like uh, get another role or, you know, like I can put that into my game as well, add it up. You know, you never know what's going to happen. It's hard. It's really early in the year as well. It's hard to, it's hard to say what could happen. But when you, when you guys have scoring players like Strom and Kaka yeah. go out, do you see that as an opportunity for yourself to maybe showcase some of your, off, your offense? Hopefully you try to. If I get the lineup, that'd be great. You know, uh, it just depends also, like, you know, if you power play minutes and stuff like that. But, you know, just, I can just control what I can control. And when it's on the ice, no matter what ice time, I just try to do my best and, you know, uh, Hope for the best, yeah.